Fancy party? Check. Bunch of strangers? Check. Grace totally not dressed for the occasion? Check. Now, if only I knew what I was supposed to be doing here. Grace, you made it. I'm so glad. I was beginning to wonder. You didn't say this was a fancy party. I feel a little underdressed. Grace, look at me. I didn't even button up my shirt. It's fine. <laughs> Why is everyone so quiet? You'd think someone died. I... I should have told you about this earlier. I've been putting it off. Let me guess. I'm a ritual sacrifice. <gasps> I'm doing a stand-up routine. Oh, no. Is this one of those dinner theater things? And I'm the murderer? You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? No deja vu recollections that aren't your own? No. Should I have? <laughs> you're cute when you're all angsty. You get this little crinkle in your forehead. <laughs> you might not think I'm so cute after I explain. You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? I don't like the sound of that. What am I missing? You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? Fancy party? Check. Bunch of strangers? Check. Grace totally not dressed for the occasion? Check. Now, if only I knew what I was supposed to be doing here. Grace? You're here. Yeah. I'm invited, aren't I? I'm just surprised you even knew it was happening. Persephone said I should come to this. Whatever this is. Persephone didn't tell you? Uh, why am I not surprised? I came to see you, Apollo, and I don't recall you mentioning it. Persephone said it could help. You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? Please don't start that again. It was bad enough at the underworld. I apologize. She should have... There are things you need to know. You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? I don't like the sound of that. What am I missing? You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? Persephone said Aphrodite could help me and that she'd be grateful I came. That's it. Persephone's not wrong, but that's not the entire story. You don't have any of Calliope's memories, right? No deja vu recollections that aren't your own? No. Should I have? Not right away. For a while, you won't remember anything. We call it the veil. In time, the veil will start to lift, slowly at first, but eventually you'll remember almost everything Calliope did. Seems like the sort of thing you should tell a new idol. New idols are usually chosen. You would know about this already, except... Except Calliope was murdered. Well, remember how old we all are. There are so many memories, so the veil lifts gradually to protect you. That doesn't seem so terrible. Am I missing something? Well, remember how old we all are. There are so many memories. That's gotta be a lot of memories. She was, what, a thousand years old? More than that. Much more. Then what happens to me in my piddly twenty-something years? It can't be good. Eventually, it's like a flood. It becomes difficult to separate what's you and what's them. And all who came before them. <sighs> I'm learning this now? What are you talking about? It, it sounds like drowning. It doesn't feel that way. I promise. You'll still be you. You'll just... also be everyone else. It sounds terrible. I don't even want to think about it. I understand. Take some time to let it sink in. If you like, we can talk about it later. I have a hard time believing I'll forget who I am. You won't stop being you. You'll just... also be everyone else who isn't you. Mm, 
Yeah, I don't buy it. I understand. That's a lot to take in. I'm not sure what to think. I understand. You're saying I won't be me. I won't be Grace. <sighs> Will I start calling myself Calliope? Maybe. Eventually, most of us do, but most of us were chosen and prepared. <laughs> and I didn't choose this. I understand. Take some time to let it sink in. If you like, we can talk about it later. What? What does this have to do with the party? Aphrodite hasn't been the same since we came to the New World. She has horrific memories of what she endured during the war. Passing on her Eidolon is a way to forget for a while. That's what this party is for. She doesn't have any other options? Therapy, pills, social media? <laughs> if you think she hasn't tried all those things, perhaps you could ask her about them. It just seems extreme, doesn't it? Yes. Yes, it is. It is, however, an extreme situation. For idols, our memories can become a prison. This is how Aphrodite chooses to escape. When you say she's gonna pass on her Eidolon, you mean... She's going to die, yes. And pass her soul on to a chosen successor. In front of everyone? We're here to help, Grace. To make it easier for Aphrodite to do what she feels she must. We're here to say goodbye. At least for a while. Why throw a party for it? Doesn't that mean everyone's here to... Watch her die? Yeah, I suppose so. We're also here to celebrate. We're here to help Aphrodite remember... before she forgets again. Yeah, sounds like a real banger. This party isn't for us, Grace. It's for her. I don't know, Apollo. I don't like the whole idea. You want her help, don't you? Yes, but... At least speak with Aphrodite before you make a final decision. She's not here just yet. Until she arrives, I suggest... Okay, so... What did Aphrodite want Calliope to do? What did she want me to do? Well, knowing Aphrodite, she'll want you to make a production of it all. She's not here just yet. Until she arrives, I suggest... Mingling. Mingling. Yeah, mingling. Talk to Eros. Or we can talk more if you like. Just try to relax, Grace. Sure, yeah. Relax. That's what this party is for, right? <laughs>